Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Let's get started with today's video. Hey guys, in this video, we're going to cover setting up activity sensor for motion triggered events. So we're going to start by clicking on the setup menu. And from the event control section, click on general event settings. In the arming section, select enabled and set, and then arrow back to the previous page. Click on event overview from the event control section. And from the image analysis events section, click on edit. Scroll down and click on the activity sensor tab noted by the letters AS. Scroll down again to reveal the current settings. Set the detection threshold to 20 and note that this may need to change later on as you fine tune the settings. Now delete the coordinates from the detection area box and then drag this control page over to reveal the camera's live image. Locate your area of interest and while holding the shift key down, click on the screen where you want your first corner of your detection area to begin. Four small yellow squares will indicate the first corner. Now release the shift key and click on the image where you want the second corner to appear. The motion box is now shown as a yellow rectangle. If you're not satisfied with your choice for the second corner of your box, just click around the image to change the yellow rectangle. And if you need to start over, just hold down the shift key again and click on the image to display your first corner. When satisfied with your selection, go back to the control window and click on add rectangle. The values for the motion box are now added into the detection area window. By default, the motion boxes are not displayed on the live image. So if you need to review where the motion boxes are, just click on the highlight area button and the detection areas will briefly highlight in yellow. If you want the detection areas to be displayed on the live image at all times, click on the drop down box for the show detection area and choose your tab. Now click on set to store your changes. Note that you can place one or more detection areas within a single image. Click on the previous page arrow twice to get back to the setup overview screen. And in the event control section, now click on recording. Scroll down to the start recording section and make sure that the image analysis AS line is highlighted. Click set and then return to the setup overview page with the back arrow button. The initial setup is complete when you click on set, close, and then OK. There are many more features, guys, at your disposal in the event control section, but this is enough to get you well on your way. Thanks again for joining us. We'll see you next time.